Never mind. I hope you've all got cups of tea. It's going to be really calm and chilled out this until something terrible happens and then I'm going to lose my shit as usual. <laughs> right, it's two o'clock. Let's begin. Welcome back to High Pington, the place that in the previous episodes got some nomads. I'm very, 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 very happy. So they've taken some food, they've taken some tools, they're living in the boarding house. But little by little they will start to move into these houses which didn't have that many people in them. So what do they do? Well largely they bring diseases and they end up in hospital. But other than that, they work. They work for me. And now I've nearly got all of this filled up with people. I still need a couple of hunters. And that's about it actually, if I'm honest. That is about it. So let's have a little look round, just seeing my beautiful square. I'm so happy with that, with my town hall, which shows all of my inventory, my production, how awesome we are. We're just about healthy, just about happy. It's good, but we're running out of tools. Oh God, we're running out of tools. Okay, that's a really bad start. We don't want to run out of tools. It's because of the nomads, you know. Well, hopefully we'll be able to trade for some tools if a trader comes in. Then over here, here we have my churchy market with the posh stone houses starting to be built, which is why I've got no stone. I love that market. It's so lovely and colourful and wonderful, isn't it? Got church by the lake and we've got the, the market just outside and we've got gatherers and foresters and hunters all living in here and having children. There we go. Right, I'm currently building a bit up here because then up here we can do more things and another load there and down here we've got the farm and as you can see they're pulling in the pumpkins I've got a storage barn full of pumpkins I need some seeds for my orchard I also need to make some more Oh, here we go with the nomads and the diseases. They've brought the diphtheria. Um, but anyway, I need to build some more pastures, which is what's going on up here, because then I can split up the animals if they start getting as infected as the people. Right, what you'll be able to see... There he is. There's the infected person who will head straight for the hospital but won't necessarily get there before they've infected somebody else. I'm saying he, it might be a woman. Let's have a look. It's, uh... Well, excuse me, why are you... It's Millermo. Yes, go to the doctor before going home, please. Good grief. Oh, you've infected somebody else now. You've infected Luston. The problem is that while they're in there, they can't be doing their jobs. But on the plus side, it looks like there's only two. So that's good. Excellent. Well, that's my little tour around what's going on. We're doing very well. This is the only game I think I've ever not played badly. It's fantastic. Got some tools coming in as well. Now, so welcome. Good afternoon to you all. This is a live stream. If you're watching this back, hello to you. And thank you for joining me a little bit later. But everybody else is in the chat and we're all relaxing because there's a storm outside and I don't like it. But there's a storm here as well and it's snowing, so that's not amazing. It's getting a bit brighter outside. It's nice. We're just saying, I need some hot drinks, but I've forgotten to get myself one. So I'm just going to have to be cold. Right, I can put a couple of hunters back on. That is good. I never find that I really need, like, 12 vendors, 6 traders. I've never felt the need. I've never felt the need. The question is, are they building this? Because this is really important. I need them to build this so I can start splitting up my animals, please. I don't want to lose all my animals. Dr. Jenny, she loses all her animals, which would be bad. Tools low again. That's the problem with nomads, they take all your stuff. Work harder, Mr. Blacksmith, please. Gonna be needing some more resources from further out. I can see some iron up here. I don't know whether they'll go up there, but there's only one way to find out. Oh, loads of iron. Any old iron. Any old iron? Any, any, any old iron? Is there stone? Yes, there is. Take all that as well, please, then. 
Oh, I can see people going back and forward. So oh, that iron's actually not that far away from here. So that's okay. That's good. Are we running out of firewood? We're running out of firewood. It's a blimming nomads again. When they live in here, so they've moved out there now, they move into the houses and they take all your stuff. On the plus side, the sun is just starting to come out, even if it is still quite cold. So hopefully we'll start keeping up with it. Have I got any firewood stored away? Sometimes I have. I so have. I will release some of the firewood in this. Yeah, taking me herbs. They're taking my coats. They're taking my tools. But I've got loads of things here. Ah, that's good. Excellent. Oh, welcome to Lion of High Park. Who says, I finally caught a Jenny live show. Yippee! Round of applause for Lion of High Park. Well done to you, Mr. Lion or Mrs. Lion. Or whatever. Mux Lion. MLK2K says they're thieving nomad locusts. Well, they're not thieving exactly. I did sort of say that they could come. In fact, I was looking forward to them. Matt Boo in Twitch has uh, has put an octopus in the chat room. I hope they're not any octopuses. Please tell me you haven't spotted like an octopus in the lake. I'm concerned. Is there a Loch Ness monster type thing in there? Oh, it's a squid. It's a squid. Well, there you go. Maybe we could eat the squid. Mmm, squid. That would be good. I'd enjoy that. What I need is more stone so that I can get my posh housing down here going. How much do we need? Yeah, I need loads of stone. It's 40 stone per per house, and I don't even have enough for one house, so that's not going to be happening for the time being. <laughs> Meanwhile, look, firewood. Now we've got too much. Well, I'll tell you what, you can build more. Build more? Chop more. Chop more firewood. <gasps> There's a trader in the house. Who is it? It's Dirotto, the seed merchant. Yes. Now, have I got enough stuff to trade you? Because you won't take blimming herbs. Damn it. Oh, no. Um, That's a bit of a problem. What could I put? What could I... Maybe more... More of these? More clothes? Possibly do some more clothes for you. Would you like that? To hope that the vendor actually brings them. Oh, that's really frustrating. I still need 360 units, apparently. Dad, it's we're gonna have to get the firewood back. How much is firewood worth? I don't know. Right, let's see. I've done it. Bring the firewood. I can see the guy with his little wheelbarrowy thing. Do you want to be a bit quicker? That would be good. No. Would you like some fish? You know I have any fish. Although I do have a lot of food. Would you like some fish? I'll sell you some fish. Where's my firewood? Oh, hang on. Is is that him? Ah! <laughs> no, it's not him. Well, what were you doing then? No, is nobody you're gonna miss out on my chestnuts? Gonna miss out on my chestnuts. That's not good. Don't make me angry. No, still not enough. <laughs> nah. Well, Doretto, just don't go anywhere, please. Oh, you brought me some firewood. Thank you very much. It looks like it's gonna be enough. It's gonna be enough. Just hold your horses there, Doretto, or whatever it is that powers your boat. Yippee! Oh, somebody died. Garstone the Gatherer ate some poisonous berries and died. Well, what a fool. What a fool. Okay, right. I don't want those tools here. Oh, there we go. Lovely. Right, great. What it means is that we can now put chestnuts there. And I'll get my last person to farm the chestnuts. Excellent. Meanwhile... They've still not built this. Oh, come on. That's ridiculous. I actually need some more nomads for hard labour. Uh -uh. 
sheep. The sheep need splitting. Right, let's take away uh, a fisherman and a couple of gatherers and a hunter for the time being because we've got quite a lot of food. They can come and do this. Oh, there we go. Matt Boo says, nomad tentacles everywhere. I thought the tentacles would all join up, but it looks calamari And player emergency says, only pie for the nomads here. That's That pie is a bit rubbish, isn't it? They had a right go at me about, uh, what do you call it? Transparency. They said my pie wasn't transparent enough, but now they've butchered it. You can just about tell it's a pie. Hello to Jack. Smiley face. I'm going to have a smiley face in a minute because look, they are building my pasture. Yippee! Meanwhile, Jack apparently is also hosting me. Thank you very, very much indeed. That is more appreciated than you'll ever know if you host Jenny. Jenny spreads further around Twitch. Right. I want uh, more pasture, don't I? For the moo moos. Make it as big as I can. Okay. What I might do actually is have. I don't know, if you have sheep next to cows, does it stop in infection from spreading as much? I don't know. Uh, if you want to host me on Twitch instantly, it's it's free, you can do it. You just need to put me into your auto-hosting list. Um, which means that my channel plays on your channel when you're not doing things. And if you never do anything, then obviously you can always have me. All Jenny, all the time. Got some chestnut trees. Come do chestnuts grow on trees? They do in this game. Got some of those filling in that little gap there. I do like to fill in my gaps. Could even have another chestnut thing here, but we'll see whether we want housing there for the farmers. I shouldn't say farmers in that terrible Somerset accent. That's uh, probably discriminatory. Uh, do we need more homes? That's the question. I could definitely get some homes in along here. Let's do that. Homes next to your fields. It's just what you've always wanted. And opposite uh, opposite this, which is probably full of drunk people, but it's fine. Mm, oh, and next to the Moo Moo's as well. Hey, done this one a bit quicker. They've got the idea. They've got the idea. I hope you're all singing along with the music. <laughs> That's enough of that. <sighs> Give you all the job. You lazy lot. Put somebody back on hunting as well. Not for the food, but because of the animal skins that you can make the coats out of. And then you can sell them. And then you can make the monies. Oh! Hello to Protector 1002, or is it 1002? I think we've had that conversation, but I don't remember the outcome of it. Yay stream! He's cheered me, thank you very much. I got a little ding there. Did anybody else get a little ding? Jenny likes dings. Should have got a ding and a sort of triangle thing. A ding and a triangle thing. I'm so, so, so good at uh, what's going on here. No citizens are able to work. What? Oh dear, all my herdsmen have died. Um, there we go, it's better. Yeah, if you ding, it means you gave me some money, which is always very much appreciated. Thank you to anybody who has cheered, subscribed, super chatted, or otherwise. If you can't do any of those things, then you just need to like it and retweet it and spread it. Spread it like the virus that it is. Oh, I've got little trees now. Look, trees. I've got some new Patreon supporters, incidentally, after the Sims highlight video of you all singing. Not quite sure how that attracted anybody, but if you were one of those, thank you very much. Hello, Englander, how are you doing? 
Oh, and Raven Enigma. He says, I'm waking up to a gameplay journey stream. It's a good morning, good morning, good morning. We're gonna buy all the seeds. Good morning, good morning to you. He takes herbs, wicked. Right, what do we want? Plums, wheat, lettuce, cherries. Mm. I love cherries. But peppers? Mm. No, I love cherries more. Thing is, I don't think I've got enough to buy them with because they're very expensive from the general goods merchant. Yeah, go away. The general goods merchant sells seeds at a massive premium, which is bad. Right, are we actually collecting the things? Oh, I can see the locusts going out there. It's just we're a bit short on stuff. But they are going out there, that's good. What I could do is ask the locust to just remove all the resources from this general area. And that general area. There's a little lake there. Oh, look at that. Oh, I could have some exclusive homes. No, this is not SimCity. Oh. But exclusive homes. Yes. Probably need some more foresters as well. And they can chop down some things. There we go. All of that's going to disappear now. As soon as the locusts start hammering away at it. I need some nomad locusts, though. I haven't got enough locusts, really. It's lovely here, isn't it? It's so relaxing. When I first got this game, I played it for hours and hours and hours because I love the music and I love the sound effects. It's like having those nature sound effects in your ears all the time. I really, really hope that you can all hear the nature because it's lovely. It's all bird song and rain and... It's, yeah, it's lovely. Not like the lightning bolt we got on City Skylines last night. My god, that nearly scared me out of my chair. I'm sure that game's getting ever darker, you know. Ever darker. Right, I'm going to move the Moomoos out into this pasture in the hope that it will be big enough to split them up. There we go. They are breeding. I think it's... Is it ten you can split at? The problem is that that only takes nine, so that's no good. What I could also do, of course... Oh, hang on a minute. What I could do, if I move the sheep into this... Yeah? Move the... No, the what? No, don't go over there! Little monsters. Right, if I make that into a cattle pasture and then I split the sheep so they come over here, because I think you can get more sheep. You can get 11 sheep in that one. Obey me. It's the sheep conga. Conga, conga, conga. Sheep go in the pasture. That's it. That's it, and then when I split those up, they can go in there and get 20. In fact, you can get 20 in there. Let's let's just move you around again. Uh, uh, uh. Except you seem to be escaping anyway. What's going on here? What are you doing? Stop harassing the deer. That's my job. Right, good. So when we've got enough in there, we can split them up. We can get 17 sheep in there and 11 sheep in there. That's good. That's worked. I'm happy with that. That's good. Right. Put a couple more foresters in and a fisherman. That's wonderful. That's wonderful. Oh, it's all cold now, but I'm all warm. <laughs> uh, lovely. Oh, here we go. Here's the seed merchant, right? Hold up. The seed merchant who isn't going to rip me off has squash. I don't think I've got squash already. I don't think I've really got anything. Trade items. Peppers, chestnuts, pumpkins, sheep and cattle. So, we need the squash. What can I persuade you to trade for? Oh, 720 units short. No! Ah, well, I've got loads of hide coats, though. I don't know why my people are not bringing me hide coats. Bring me hide coats, damn it! This is why. You know what I was saying? Oh, I don't know why I need so many traders. That's why. Because <laughs> they don't bring things very quickly. Right, come on. I want these seeds. Could pay for it in firewood. That would probably be better. Firewood's quite easy to come by, whereas the other things, not so much. Look at all this fishing going on as well. All this fishing activity. Wonderful. Right, got some more firewood here. Only a little bit, though. Merkley says, This reminds me of my settlements building in Fallout 4. Just as lovely, until raiders show up and then heads are rolling. What, their heads? Your heads? 
I hope they're heads. No raiders show up here. This is one thing actually about this. I mean, it ultimately is a casual game, isn't it? Let's let's face it. It is a casual game. It's not SimCity. Um, but there's no real disasters. You get fires sometimes. You get the odd tornado. But that's about it, really. Nothing else really really goes on to say. Which is a bit of a pity. I mean, don't get me wrong, I don't really like disasters very much, but... The one thing that gets you in this almost every time is starvation, and I don't know why. I don't know what it is about starvation. You Suddenly you've got no food. You add loads of food and then you have no food, and I don't know why that is. But it's very annoying. Oh, 820 units. Let's pull in teeth, this. Let's put some more traders on. Now that I've got some more people. Get some more gatherers on as well. Bring me the things! Perhaps you've already brought me the things. And the, no, you haven't brought me the things. I say, perhaps I'm commanding you to bring me things that don't actually exist. You've been very good, Doretto. I think it's because you know I'm going to give you some business. But you will go eventually. And then I'll have to send it all back. Uh, nice to see some logs going on here. We need logs to build homes. Homes along the river bank here. It's river front, river harbour area. It's all about harbours with me at the moment, isn't it? There are lots and lots and lots and lots of harbours. This isn't happening. Um, is it warm coats that we've got rather than wool coats? That seemed to inspire a, a wheelbarrow then. Aha. Still not enough though, is it? Right, what I'm going to have to do, I think, Doretto, is I'm going to have to ask you to buy me the things, buy me the things, bring me the things that I don't already have. You can buy me the things that I don't, I don't have if you want. Those are all the things that I don't already have, I think. And you you go away for a while, and then I'll build up some things in my inventory. And then we'll talk again. So, let me send some of the firewood back for the time being. Lots of tools, got no problem with tools at all. It was warm coats that we've we are producing, so some more of those, and when the seed merchant returns, we will be buying all the seeds. <sighs> food has gone down a little bit there. Just a little bit. I think all of my foodie people are currently out. Yes, they are. Gonna need some more fields. Can I put another field in here, or is there a hill? I don't know. Let's have a look. Um, oh, actually, what we could have is the apiary and the creamery. Mmm, creamery. Cheese. Yes. Creamery cheese. Mm -mm -mm. Where do you want to go? Could be a sort of internal building. Or should we have the creamery down here? Is it like, is it a posh thing? We could put it here. I'm going to put it here. Mmm, creamery. Creamery butter. What's that episode of The Simpsons where she goes, we start with a whole pat of creamery butter. <laughs> Can't remember, but it does make me laugh. It seems to have a lot more iron now, but not very much stone. Oh, look at the firewood situation. Well, now, whew, we're filling. Whoa, 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 no. <laughs> Hang on, what have I done there? That's not right. Oh, sort by name, sort by quantity. Oh, quantity's easier. There we go. Right, get some more firewood in. Protector says if you order stuff, it comes as a premium. Oh, gonna get ripped off again then, aren't I? That's no good. Mind you, no more ripped off than buying certain seeds twice by accident. So, we've got plenty of herbs, although not perhaps as many as I would hope. Got a fair bit of food, a fair bit of firewood, loads of tools, loads of clothes. We're good, really, aren't we? We're good. Stone is the next thing. I need stone so that I can start converting some of these houses. Because when there's a fire, we're all going to die. <laughs> Hello to Paputin. 
who says, hey ya, chatters, hey ya, hey ya, hey ya. Da, 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 da. Right, there's a bit of st uh oh, oh, <gasps> an outbreak of influenza has occurred. Right, who's got the flu? Who is it? Where are you? Dan. No, really, where are you? Are you hiding? Are you already in the hospital? Oh, you are already in it. Right, you're forgiven then. It tries, but it fails, you see, because I've got an hospital. Anyway, what was I doing? I was noticing there was some stone over here. Sorry, it looked like I was randomly, fairly aimlessly doing things there, but I wasn't. Look, stone. Just have all of it, couldn't we? Including that bit on the other side. I don't care how far you've got to go and go and get it. Chop down all of that. Chop it. The firewood's low again. Are you kidding me? Make your mind up. Do I need another woodcutter? If I put another woodcutter in, and what would a woodcutter cut? If a woodcutter could cut wood. I don't really want another one. I don't really want it there. Let's put it over here. Or somewhere. I just don't want them all in the same place. Perhaps I could actually put him in the forest. Cutter in the forest. Because then he's got somewhere to put all of that. Because all the logs are here, you see. Yeah, that would do. How about there? There. Lovely. Won't have to go very far then. Has it stopped being cold now? It's 34 degrees. Brr, I'm going to guess that that's not cel Celsius centigrade. Celsius centigrade. There we go. I've built my creamery. It's time for some creamery butter. If I can find it. Oh, oh, I need two. I need two dairy, dairy men. It might be women, you know. They can make yoghurt, they can make cheese, and they can make cream. It's got to be cheese, isn't it? What else is it going to be? This is a mod. It's a big barn. And at the back of the barn, there are some barrels. And that's where the magic happens. Or something. <laughs> There's also a ladder to get away. I don't know whether that's in case the cheese turns on you or something. I'm not really sure. A bit weird. But it's saying I have no milk. Oh, now it's saying we have got milk. We've got milk. There's been a delivery of milk. Excellent. We're going to have cheese. Yippee! Mmm, cheese. The reserve of firewood is low. What, again? <laughs> this guy over here needs to get on with it, doesn't he? <gasps> oh, whoa. Stop everything. Stop everything. Stop your cutting. Nomads! Allow, allow 14 nomads. Yes, 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 yes. Absolutely. Please do come in and take all my things. Right. Meanwhile, I've got a food merchant. I'm just wondering whether to buy some emergency food, given that no, we have now have nomad hell. I'll just use the nomads to fill in all the jobs here. The most of the jobs here. Because I still don't think I really need more than one vendor. It's a bit of a rip-off. Ah, do I need... Oh, I tell you what, let's have some chicken. Because we don't get that very often. You can have some tools in return, because I've got loads of tools. I even give you a bit of a free tool. Oh, how does that sound? Half a free tool. Oi! Oh, it won't let me. Oh, I haven't got enough. All right, we'll have, have some extra firewood, but not that much. Have six bits of firewood. Oh, that actually makes it perfect. Excellent. Right. So we've got some chicken. That's good. <gasps> Look, cheese. And it's bright yellow. Bright yellow cheese. Just wondering whether to have the rest of that, but never mind. There we go. Hello to Mike. Merkley says, why is it called banished? Because... I think they've been banished and they just, when you start, you just get some people and a very small amount of stuff. So I'm assuming that um, you've been banished from somewhere. I don't actually know. Can't lie. I don't know. Dora the Forester has died during childbirth. That's terrible. 
That's terrible. Right, should we have the uh, the bee place? Where do we want the bees? Oh, we'll have them next to the creamery. The bees and the cheese next to each other in perfect harmony. Come on then, locusts, make some well, nomadic locusts indeed. Make yourself useful, please. I'm gonna need another load of cows to keep up with the demand for the cheese. Split, split the cows. Come on, in you come. In you come, over here, right now. You've already half escaped, why not escape in the right direction? That'd be great, thank you. Oh, excellent, right, that's good. Moo, it's very noisy over there, isn't it? Oh, look at my chestnut trees now. We're even getting some chestnuts. Oh, now that I've said that, they're disappearing. In fact, they've gone. Ah, oh, excellent. Oh, hello, Zombie Media. How are you doing? I'm doing very well here. Playing Banished Badly is a little bit of a misnomer. Matt Boo is in Twitch is trying to use an emoticon which hasn't worked. It's broken, chat. Oh, dear. Right, what do I want? Uh... No, I don't want any of those. I want another feed. Oh, I can put another one in. Yay! There we go. I'm gonna need a path along there. Excellent. Right. We'll have peppers in this one. Mmm. Meat. Pepper cheese pie. With honey uh, in yogurt for dessert. Yes. Go. Oh, apparently the emoticon thing is working fine on Twitch. Well, unfortunately, I'm in that sort of restream chat thing where I can't quite see. So you'll have to tell me what it was. Because <laughs> to me, it was static dash cdn dot jtvnw.net slash emoticon slash v1 slash 90076 slash 1.0. Smiley face, maybe. Some of them work and some of them don't, because I saw the, um, what do you call it earlier, the uh, calamari. <laughs> my schoolhouse is full. Oh my god, we're going to need another school. Probably Jesus school. Definitely Jesus school. Next to the church. Sunday school. Well, as long as the nomadic locusts are educating themselves. Look at all this food. Oh, look at it. This food. The market's just full of food. It's all food stalls. That's glorious. Still think we're missing a flag, though. I mean, what is that? A lightning rod? I don't know. It would. Right. Here we go. Oh, it's the general goods merchant who has steel tools. He's got lots of seeds. Pecan seeds, squash seeds, apple seeds, potato seeds, potato. Can I afford your potatoes? That's the question. Oh, 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 uh, yep. Yes, I can. Go on then, I'll take them, but get out of my sight. Because now I'm going to have to make sure that nobody tries to put any stuff back in here. Ah. Got enough coats. We have got enough tools, actually. That's fine. Tools is fine. Oh, I do wish it wouldn't do that. That's really annoying. We don't have any hide coats because we don't make them anymore. But herbs? No. The herbal people are not doing very well, I have to say. Um, that's really annoying. Damn. No, don't do that. By name, please. <laughs> right, no herbs. No herbs. Hide coats, have you got any? Uh, warm coats, maybe not that many for the time being. Right, herbalists. Why are we not herbling? That's a bit worrying. That happens sometimes as well, actually. Sometimes you end up without... Um, without any herbs, for no apparent reason. Even though you've got all the herbalists doing all the herbling everywhere. All my herbs are disappearing! Right, there's no herb list up here, so let's put one up here. If I can remember where it is. It's that little flower, isn't it? It's a little flower. There we 
we go. Ratner, hello to you, says, what is the objective of the, I'm assuming you mean stream, uh, to, basically, to stay alive. Because that doesn't happen very often, frankly. Normally, it's total disaster. Get more children. I reckon that's probably part of it. More children and more herbs. We need more herbs. We don't have many herbs. Make herbs a priority, please. Over here. Dun, dun. That's the herb disco. That's the building disco. I do wish they'd turn the base down. God, that's made them do it though, hasn't it? Wow. Get in. Speaking of making people do things, there are now 30 people here! That's awesome! Give yourself a round of applause. You can tell that the weather's really bad outside, can't you? 30 people! 12 of them are in Twitch. I'm sure that 12 in Twitch is some sort of record, you know. That's very exciting. Not much chat going on in Twitch, though. I think they're wondering who I'm speaking to. I'm speaking to the chat in YouTube, because I can see both at once. But you can't talk to each other. I can only relay your messages. Which must be polite. <laughs> uh. Right. Off that. I've lost all the windows, look. Have I lost all my window? Have I lost my window? I've lost my window. Oh god, that means I've got to get my window back. Uh which one was it? Jobs? Assigning jobs to citizens? There we go. Zombie Media in YouTube says hello other chat to Twitch. He also says it's sunny in ba Sunny? What's the sun? <laughs> We haven't had any of that since last weekend, when it was actually really nice. It's gone horrible again. Putin also says hello. Player Emergency says, reminder to all at Twitch, click the follow button if you haven't already done that. Absolutely. The follow button, the like button, the host button, the cheer button, the subscribe button, you know, those things. Right, I'm about to get some more herbs here. Yippee! Right, where is Herbalist? It's there, there we go, lovely. And then we got... Ooh, we've got some cream, berries, apple and corn. I'm sure if you mix together the berries, the apple and the cream, that would be amazing. But that's not really what I want right now. Matt Boo is waving to the dark side. That's you, YouTube. Uh, that's good. Right, we've got loads of firewood again. Plenty of tools. All sorts of things. Just wondering when disaster is going to strike. In fact, I've got so many logs now, we can't even cope. I will let you, I will permit you to do more logs. But you are also going to need somewhere to put said logs. You also need a a track. Have I not, have I not given you a, a road? That's very unlike me. Oh dear, we better have a road. And you can sneak down to there. And I will give you another place to put the stuff, I think. That would probably be the best idea, would it not? Just doing a bit of bashing there. We've got some sunflowers. I'm not quite sure how they're surviving in this weather, but anyway. Um, right, where's the... Uh, I keep forgetting where everything is. Where's the storage unit? Am I going silly? Oh, I am. It's there. Ah, there we go. Stockpile. Do a thin, thin stockpile. There we go. Oh, that's nice now. We've got some mushrooms, we've got some sunflowers, and we've got whatever that is. It's good for you, whatever it is. So much work going on. So much work. They are good, really. They don't complain much. That should solve some problems. My herbs have already gone up. That's good. My coats are coming down there, probably because it's been a very, very cold winter. But have you seen how much stone I've got? Right, let's start. I can either make some more posh houses around here, or I can start making these into posh houses. I think I'll build some more posh houses. We haven't had any houses in a while. 
so along there that works does it not I think. Yep. look at them they're desperate to do it they're desperate 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 to build me my empire ah the music's back lovely russell says do they have a sniper tower do they need a sniper tower are there rampaging gangs of people who are not going to politely ask us to move in at town hall maybe there should be maybe that's what this game is missing somebody should take this and make like banished expanded like rival towns more food market economy taxes funny names for things yes oh there we go right is anybody going to move in whoa 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 yes they are good lord three children that's quite unusual and then we've got a couple there and last but not least da 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 duh is no no nobody want to build it duh duh what's wrong with this one is there a problem thank you woman in purple Miss Denny is making your home. Thank you. There we go. Lovely. Wonderful. That's good. Stunning. Lion says what they need is a wizard's tower for shocking things. Yes. Yes, they do. I've got loads of spare locusts now. This is brilliant for when disaster inevitably strikes. Let me ship some firewood out here because we're going to need it, no doubt, to buy stuff. And look how many tools now! So many tools, right. We'll ship some of those out as well. Streaming locusts, they're just streaming. Streaming everywhere. Oh, look, they're bringing in the peppers! They're all red peppers. In fact, they're chilli peppers. That's not a bell pepper, that's a chilli pepper. Mmm, chilli peppers, yes. Spiced pumpkin cheese thing. You could make spiced pumpkin cheese thing. A bit of a graphical glitch there. Must be the edge of a hill. Look, they're bringing in the pumpkins as well. Normally we miss some of the pumpkins because of the weather, but we don't seem to be having any such trouble this autumn, I have to say. That's good. How are we doing for storage? With all the peppers and all the pumpkins, we are okay. We're about to crack five figures of food. Mmm. Five figures of food. There's the title of this episode. You need more places to sell it, don't you? What you need is one of these little shops what I have modded in. Little general store. It's slightly smaller than a market, but look. Would you like one over here? Or maybe... Oh, the posh bit's got a market. Would you like one in the town? I think you would. Maybe I could put it here in the corner. There we go. Let's see what that brings. Oh, look at them. They're desperate. Let's slow, let's just slow it down. This is supposed to be relaxing. I always find that one makes me want to cry because I've never seen anybody move so slowly. Two sort of looks normalish. They still look like they're not quite, quite right for me. But five... I know the little legs are moving, but that looks kind of right to me. That looks kind of... How far are we from getting a general store? Mmm, general store. We're selling the foods. You can see some foundations being snowed on there. Bashy bashy. You can go and bashy bashy the deer after that, you know. You should be able to select deer. <laughs> Hurt. Hey! Wow, that's a bit yellow quite tall it's got a massive is that a chimney or is it just a bit that all the snow can get caught in i don't know that sort of towers over everything doesn't it for a little i thought it was going to be a little tiny store and it's more like tesco extra what's going on there oh ding ding potato seeds we've not got potatoes yet have we i don't think 
Oh, we have got potatoes. Oh, go away then. Don't want your stupid potato seeds. Oh, I thought I oh, didn't save the custom order. Oh, I don't need those. Don't need peppers. Don't know if we need those things, but anyway. Right, every visit, Doretto. Every visit. Matt Boo says that's the sniper tower that they wanted, cunningly disguised. Goodness sake, you're obsessed, you lot. Right, who do I need to talk to about that? Is it traders? Um, I'm not seeing a job. Is it vendor? Oh, it's a vendor. He uses a vendor. So the stuff that you couldn't have gone and got from the barn for free, you now have to buy in the general store. <laughs> That's brilliant. No citizens are available to work. I thought I'd just put all the vendors in. Oh, that's weird. Oh, right. Well, I've discovered why I need more vendors now, because they all work in there, in that huge place with a big dome. Oh, it's a dome! It's turned into a dome. Well, that's very kind of cross between oldie English and kind of half Russian, Spanish, Catholic. Hang on a minute, that's not a dome. That's a sniper rifle! <laughs> Uh, no, it isn't. I think that's a telescope, but all you're looking at is the top of the blooming town hall, you fools. What a strange place. Anyway, it seems to be popular. Who am I to argue? He uses all the vendors that I have no other use for, so there you go. Should we have a look what other small shops we've got? What else have we got? A farm stand and a trading post. No, farm stand. Farm stand's what we don't have. Oh, that is tight. Now, you see, that's more what I wanted, a farm stand. Well, it stands to reason that a farm stand should be on a farm. So we'll put the farm stand... Can I put it here in this gap? Oh, yes! It fits perfectly! Behind the trees. Now you can't see it. Look, here! Yay! Oh, that's awesome. I'm going to have a little farm stand by the farm. I think that general store is a bit wanting to be everything. But the farm stand hopefully will just be something relating to the farm. Right, come on then, build the farm stand, please. Oh, that's perfect. That couldn't have been any more perfect, could it? All the animals are going mad over that. Bah. Got a little uh, wood thing there. Yeah, you saw that thing and you bashed that thing and you died. That Deloise the Dairyman has died during childbirth. That's bad. But I've got loads of locusts, spare locusts now, so it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Matt Boo says it does have general in the title, that's true. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's colourful and lovely. And behind the trees so we can't see it. Brilliant. That looks like the sort of thing that you'd find at a medieval reenactment, doesn't it? It's even got a little... a little... it's got a little thingy and some trees. Wow, I need so many vendors. So many vendors. Ah, all the vendors. Now, everybody's a vendor. Well, you've brought your own trees. Thank you very much for that. You see, we can't see it, chestnut trees. Don't make me cut you. We're going to have to come back in winter and have a look at that. How frustrating. Meanwhile, we don't have many children going on, do we? Is the reason why... Please have children, all of you. Is it just not enough houses? You see, this is when it starts going wrong. You think, oh, put in loads of houses. And the next thing you know, uh, you've got no resources, you've got nothing. And it all goes terribly, terribly wrong. Really wrong. But that won't stop me. Got virtually no iron either. Right, everybody drop what you're doing. We need to get resources. Come and clear all of this, please. It's so many resources. Occasionally, you know, in this game, I try to start more than one town, which isn't terribly effective. There's a bit of a laugh, though. Right, come on then, locusts. I want to see you streaming. Streaming into the woods. That's not really streaming, is it? That's more just a couple of you decided to follow my instructions. Oh, 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 hello. Here we go. I should probably give you somewhere to put that stuff that's a bit nearer. Um, 
can we just do a stockpile thing out here and then you don't have to worry about where things need to go. Somebody else can do that when we actually need them. How does that work for you? Make it your priority. It will save you a lot of time in the long run. It's a priority disco. Oh, goodness, we're playing some sort of high-energy techno. There. I hope you can hear that sound effect, because otherwise you're going to have no idea what I'm on about at all. Russell Small is getting some snacks. I hope that you should be getting snacks for everybody. You should be getting snacks for all of us, everybody. All 33 people here. Wow. That's really cool. Remember, at 50, I do open the mystery prize bag. I think you're right, Player Emergency. I think that 14 viewers is a record on Twitch. Hello to Twitchy people everywhere. Please hit host, hit love, hit like, hit follow. And if you really like something, you can cheer for it. Right, here we go. They're starting to bring the stuff in now. That's good. Bringing in the stuff. Bringing in the stuff. Hello to new followers, Urban Neurosis and Bo Elving, or it could be Beaverling. Oh, hello. Urban Neurosis joins us in chat. He says Banished is better than every other game. I wouldn't perhaps go quite that far. But for streaming on a rainy, nasty Sunday afternoon, it is really quite relaxing, isn't it? Thank you for joining me. If you didn't know, I have a Patreon. <laughs> oh, Shroom Girl, hello to you. I'm not sure what that icon is, but it just, I think it says, yeah. I'm not sure what's underneath. <laughs> so yeah. But welcome to you. Protector says, what software are you using to multi-stream and why did you choose the one that you chose? I'm using Restream.io because it's free and I stumbled across it by accident. <laughs> That's the long and the short of it. <sighs> well, I've still got a children problem here, haven't I? Need more homes. More homes for the peeps. Where am I going to put them, though? That's the question. Oh, it's winter. Let's have a look at the farm stand. Oh, look, it's all red and yellow. I think there's meat hanging up and stuff. It's very popular. It's obviously a place to gather, isn't it? It's awesome. Have to have some more of those. Uh, I don't need any more cattle. But what we do need is chickens. We need... Every visit. Chickens, every visit. Oh my god. If you weren't here last night, sorry if you've already heard this, or indeed if you were there, we streamed last night. Cities, Skylines, the Green Cities expansion. I'm going to upload the first part of that live stream tonight because... Actually, it's the second part that's got the chicken bus in it, but yeah. End up with a ride on the chicken bus and... Uh, yeah. It went about as well as you can expect. Especially when we couldn't get off the chicken bus. But anyway, I'm going to put another pasture in here. Because then, when the chickens turn up... Oh dear. Can't get much of a pasture... Pather? Pather? Can't get much of a pather in there, can I? Uh, uh, there? There. There. Right. If I do a little dirt road for you... And then we can all use all this for storage. Yeah, that works. That works. That works. Big storage. That's big storage. And then we'll have little storage. Even smaller storage. And uh, storage. <laughs> yeah. I might fill in mid dirt road as well, as there are little gaps where I could not have things. That's worked very well, actually. That's worked perfectly. I don't know why I'm trying to fill in gaps that aren't there. That's brilliant. Right, I need some builders. Now I've got loads and loads and loads of adults and not many children. We have a new follower. Thank you to Player Emergency for keeping me appraised of this. It is Positus. I'm positive you will thoroughly enjoy it here. Also, your name rhymes with bus. So, uh... You just sort of fit, don't you? Oh, look how much food I've got now. 
Yikes. Gonna need some more storage soon, I reckon. Look, 100% full there. Right, let's get some more storage in. If nothing else, we can shelter from the rain. Shall I put the barns here? Oh, I can only put one barn in? Oh no! Oh no, two barns. There we go. Or maybe three. Three barns. Oh, loads of barns. Oh, right. Well, forget that then. Oh, forget that one. Just build them here. Back. Zombie Media says that cow sounds like a klaxon. It does, doesn't it? A mooga! Right, where are you coming from? Are you having to walk round the fields? It's possibly not massively helpful, but never mind. You'll live. Oh man, speaking of klaxons, stop everything. Stop it all. And we've got 11 nomads requesting to sit. Ugh. Should I let them in? So far, they've brought in influenza and diphtheria. Should we go for the set and hope that they bring in, like, I don't know, what's a really nasty. Yellow fever. Let's see if they bring in yellow fever, but I will allow it. Gonna need more homes, though. Gonna need more homes. Living in the posh homes. What have I got too much of now? Oh, logs again. So many logs. It's log, it's log, it's big, it's heavy, it's wood. It's log, it's log, it's better than bad, it's good. But I need some chickens, because this is going to be for chickens. It won't let me make it for chickens, because I ain't got any chickens. It's no use. Do another one down here as well, and I can split the chickens up. Uh, food, pasture. How big can I make that? Not big enough. Okay. About, whoop, about there. There? Yeah, there. That's not brilliant, is it? But never mind. At least the path can go down here. There we go. Double path, in fact, triple path. There we go. I have to do a bit of bashing on that one. As long as they're split up and away from each other, it's fine. Oh, look at all my food. Look at all my food. So much food. And so many locusts. This is going really, really worryingly well. Like, really worryingly well. I don't think I've ever played a game where things have gone so well. So much so that I'm going to give you all the vendors that you want. I've now filled every single job. That's a scary thought. There we go, got another place for the chickens. What's going to go terribly wrong? Something is going to go... In fact, before I go any further, I'm saving this. Because I do not trust anything here. There we go. Resume. Get some more firewood down here in time. For the... Uh, is it the seed dude? Is the seed dude back? Yep, it has some squash seeds. I thought we already had squash. Maybe we don't. Oh, we don't have squash. Right, I will have your squash. Thank you. In exchange for lots of firewood. Okay, lots and lots of firewood. Okay, in exchange for some tools then. Whoop. Oh, no, I don't want to overpay. There we go. Trade. Lovely. You dismiss you. And then make sure they don't take all the firewood away or the tools because then we'll get into trouble I think we're alright put a few more coats in there I think we're okay oh look at how many herbs I've got now yippee well that worked as well that's brilliant Ah, wonderful right we can slow down now let's slow down slow it down let's go back to relaxing 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 at the farm stand Oh, it is a little social meeting area. That's good. I like that. We should have tables and chairs outside. Maybe you could go and sit in the forest. Go and sit in the little orchard and eat your food. Oh, if only. Ah, glorious. Right, I've been going for an hour. I'm going to have to take a break, I'm afraid. But there are a lot of you around, so what I would suggest is that we do a part two. But, hmm... Do you want part two of Banished 
Or do you want part two of something else? We could do a something else. Um, I'm just trying to think if I've got any really silly games. I've got things like Coffee Shop Tycoon. That's always good for a laugh. Or... Um, we did Lunch Track Tycoon. It was awful. So was Fabulous Food Truck. That wasn't particularly good either. Cook Serve Delicious. It could be foody, it could be banished -y, it could be oblivion -y, it could be anything you like, really. We've already had an episode of Oblivion this morning, please make sure that you watch that. It's got a cool thumbnail. I got bored of the black and white ones, so I did some new ones. Um, or I can quickly pause this and then hope that you all come, come back for Banished again. It's entirely up to you, chat. I lay this open to you. What would you like? I was only going to do until 3 o'clock, to be honest, but... There's just so many people here, I don't know how I can't do a bit more. Road OCD says, can we go back to Bussy Lag? Nobody else is talking. Lion of High Park says, more banished! Lovely, fluffy snow. Zombie Media says, anything, I'm easy to please. <laughs> Matt Boo's going to bed. Where are you then? Because it's only three o'clock in the afternoon here, so you must be either up extraordinarily late on the west coast of America, or... You must be miles ahead in the... like in Japan or somewhere? Tell us before you go. I'm really interested. Ba Protector says banished. For Putin says all games are good. Not all of them. Not all of them. Some of them are terrible. <laughs> I'd quite like to do banished, but before I pause... I really want to see where Matt Boo is in the world. I hope he hasn't already gone or we might be here a while. Oh, you're in Australia. So it's, what, one o'clock in the morning or something there? Good Lord. Wowzers. Isn't it exciting when somebody in Australia can watch you? On the other side of the world. That's amazing. Right, I think we'll do Banished again because we did two, uh, two episodes of... Uh, the city's thing yesterday. So, yep. I'm going to take a bit of a breather and shall we say about quarter past, twenty past three UK time? Oh, it's ten o'clock on the west coast. You're alright then. Um, <laughs> there's a few Australians here. Why? Why? It must be it must be quite late. Ten o'clock on the west coast of Australia. Is that all it is? Good lord. Well, there you go. Right, I'm going to have to take a break because I've been going for ages and I need a drink if nothing else. So go and go and get yourself a drink and we will reconvene for some more action from Hypington in a few minutes.